Hi guys and welcome back to our Mountain Blade 2 Bannerlord Part 5 Episode 5 of our playthrough. Um, so in the last episode we managed to complete our quest establishing a clan. We managed to get the final bits of renown that we needed. And we've just been informed by a Radagos that our brother and family have, are being held captive in a nearby hideout. So we're going to go and meet him there, assault the hideout and hopefully rescue our family. That is the next stage of our quest. So we're going to go ahead and do that now. Head over there right away. Not too far to go so we'll be right there any moment now. In fact we'll just speed up, get there nice and quick. Here we are. Radagos, you finally arrived. I have a few things to say before we attack. We have to be clever. Clever. Galta is a cunning fellow in a low and base kind of way. I defeated you before. I know how your gang operates. Less talking, more raiding. Come on! Come on! That you did. That you did. Lead on then. Wait until nightfall. Do 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 do. Cue elevator music. And let's go, it's the attack. Who do we want to take? Um, who do we want to take? I think we want to take a couple of archers. We're going to take him. Just We're only going to take him. I know he's not the best soldier we've got, but we want to upgrade him a little bit. We'll have a look. Yeah, hopefully in this episode, we'll have a look at outfitting him with some better equipment. And um, see what's more suited to his skills. But yeah, we kind of just hired him to have the companion bit filled. Don't want to take the equities because I don't want to lose them. Okie dokie. Let's do this. We're not going to follow what it says there, we're just going to tell our troops to charge because I'm quite confident that our men should be able to handle it. Probably shouldn't have bought the uh, giant ass glaive with me, but. Uh. Die, you bastards! There we go, one down. Yeah, let's be subtle, lads. Somehow he hasn't noticed. <laughs> look at the legionaries, they look so cool. Proper, like, Eastern Roman Empire sort of kit they have, isn't it? Beautiful, absolutely love these guys. Especially with their pelum, their javelins. Kill him now. You'll never know. Okay, you guys do that. I'm just gonna head this way. I think, yeah, all my men are a bit faster than me, which is kind of annoying. But the more we work on our athleticism, the faster we should get. I mean, the archers are like massively faster than I am. Got kind of like a Robin Hood vibes going on here, aren't I? Nope, we lost someone. I didn't see if that was an injury or a death. Hopefully, that was an injury. I don't know who it was. Right, you guys take him out. I'm going to run down here. Hopefully, get there before you, so I can actually kill someone myself. Doesn't look like there is anyone down here. There, there, there he is. There's the. Poor bugger. Let's go and take him on. No, it was he was mine. Ow! He took through full 360 there, didn't he? Five bodyguards and the chieftain. Bastards! You're the king, king of my captives, right? I saw Radagos with you. You know he can't be trusted. He led us here. Where are my brother and sister? Nah. There's no more talking. Kill me or I'll kill you. That's how this ends. Very well. I'll duel you. Oh, that was close. Come on. There we go. Have it. Have it. Have it. Yeah, what are you looking at, huh? Yeah, what are you looking at, huh? One thumb of me. 
manages the female at least stop. This is embarrassing. All done. Look, we can still talk. I'll give you a pouch of silver. You said talking was a waste of time. You're Radicals is property now anyway. Galter's execution by Radagos. Execute him. Ooh, ah. What? We don't get to see it. Oh well. Awesome feature though. Oh my party's increased in size. I can now have 45 troops. Now that is some useful information. Empire peasants. You know, I'm going to leave them. I think recruits might be the better way to go. For now. Nothing good, but a bit of food, which is always helpful. Saves me having to buy it. No grand. Wow, you let your hair grow out. Whew, how long have you been taken? Rafael, I knew you'd come. Great heaven. Damn, brother. Nothing can stop you. I love you, brother. So glad to see you safe. Is everyone okay? Yes, we're all fine. Alda and Varric are scared, but fine. We need to be quick and get the hell out of this place. I'll take Alda and Varric to Unrira, Unira immediately. There we will be safe. Meet me there later uh, when you're ready to tell me everything. Okay, be careful. As you leave the hideout, Radios comes and asks to talk. Well, looks like we've gotten your kin back to you. So my end of the deal is complete. I'll be making myself scarce now. Don't let your conscience bother you about letting me go, by the way. I won't get back into slaving. Burn too many bridges with my old colleagues, you might say. I'll find some other way to earn my keep. Mercenary work, perhaps. Anyway, maybe our paths will cross again. Your men killed my parents. Did you really think you would not be punished? Maybe. Goodbye, Radagos. Hey, well, I dared to hope, I suppose. Alright then. I'm not going to grovel to you, so get it over with. I shall. For your many crimes, Radagos, your life is forfeit. Perhaps by saving my brother and sister, you earned your life back. Very well. Go now. Yeah, go on then. We'll let him live. Might be useful later on. We'll let him live. Right, awesome. So we've managed to rescue our family. I, what did I just click on? Clan. All oh, right. Oh, there's me. Hey. Varric and Alder. Oh, yeah, they are young. Yeah, they both got better horses than I bloody do. Last seen at Onira. Oh, so they're all with Nogand at Onira. That's where our family is. Oh, we can see our expenses here as well. Parties, caravans, garrisons, dispatched. Roll. All right. Oh, awesome. It's not really got any uh, useful skills, has he, that guy? Probably could have got myself a better companion, but, you know, he's my companion now. I can deal with him. Awesome. So, our job now is to just kind of, we're just going to build up, level up, find a, a route to go down. Obviously, we'll try and complete this as and when we can. But for now, let's try and build up an income. Um, yeah, yeah. we'll see where it goes from here. We might look at serving a kingdom or just serving ourselves. Village needs drought. Oh, yeah, I'm not going to do that because it's expensive. I'm just going to recruit some men for now. I'm going to go to some villages around the area. See what I can find. Could be travelling to Anira. I'm sure we've got some loot to sell. Whoa. Shall I take him on? <laughs> no. Hey, there he is. I mean, is there anything I can do with it? Talk Captain. Is that it? We can't. Well, I mean, I suppose we can get him to join us. Yeah, might as well. No reason why not. May as well come with us. Recruit troops. Always forget we can recruit them straight from the cities. 
Yeah, no Vigler recruits. I don't know where we got them from before. You can't seem to get them from anywhere else. Oh wow, we left at the right time. Ooh. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Yeah. Nice, big, fat, juicy party there. Where's he in the middle? Have at me. Cavalry. Follow me. We're gonna circle around. My two beautiful equites. Equites. My two equites. Come on, boys, we're gonna hit their left flank. Ow! Jesus! That hurt. Oh, what? Why does this keep happening? Come on. I got taken out by a pitchfork. Go on, men, how about them? See what I apparently couldn't. Infested by a bloody pitchfork, honestly. Can't make it up. Well, that was awful. Well, at least we killed them all. Bit renowned, bit morale, two injured, me included. Uh, how many archers have we got? Only got a couple, yeah. We'll just convert those four to archers for now. Grab the loot. Finish them off. Send troops. Hopefully nobody is stupid enough like me to die to these guys. No, luckily they're not. I'm putting off buying the horses for them guys because I just know how expensive it's going to get. Okay, well that was uh, awful. Moving on. Let's go sell some stuff, heal up a little bit. And carry on. So my goal is, I think I've decided, is if we aim to get like a good party of maybe about 60, 70 strong men and then we'll maybe start attacking one of the major factions just start kind of maybe prodding them attack caravans and uh, try and make some money that way maybe loot some villages, oh yeah, no I completely forgot I won that didn't I? idiot, should have worn that earlier <laughs> oh well, sell the rest of that let's have a look at the horses, just out of curiosity how expensive are they? I suppose we could get two of those. They're not too bad. They're not too bad. And because of everything I'm selling, I only have to pay 200. So we'll... Required. War horse. Ah, oh, what do I get? Horse archers or... Nah, I've got to improve those guys first, haven't I? No more horse archers, not for the moment. I don't have enough health to take these guys on, but I'll just keep kind of like keep behind them for now. Keep close. Be good if we can find some more little hideouts as well. Seventeen. I think I need twenty percent. There we go. Should be okay now. Should be fine. Go on. Don't be shy. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. All right, let's charge them. My new. I don't even know what they are. Elite cavalry. <laughs> yeah, real elite. <laughs> God damn it. No, stop it. <laughs> Making me look bad. 
There we go, that's what I was trying to do last time. Just didn't go very well. Shut up, leave me alone. That's it, slaughter them. damage on him. He's got to be low. Oh, come on. There we go. There we go. Damn it. Bloody tree. I mean, I feel like I'm the only one actually trying. Come on, come on, there we go. I think the rest of these might be able to escape. Who the hell is that? Are you fast? He kept up with us and we we're on horses. What? How's he so fast? Ooh, 1.4 on renown, three upgrades. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, one more up show on infantry. Do I not press done? That's what I did. There we go. Awesome. Another party done for. We're going to try and avoid that place because it's not looking too good at the moment. Oh wow. They're attacking that place as well. Oh no. That's just been taken over I think. Doesn't normally belong to the Empire. The desert might be a good place to look for some uh, opportunities to make money, I reckon. We'll just head over here and see if we've got any men we can recruit while we're here. One, two, three, four. Puts us at 36. I think... Is that the place I just went to? It might have been. We'll also head to Degressos. Deliver her to Mysea. Yeah, you know what, we will do that. Oh, yes! Perfect. Vigler recruit. Actually, was that that same guy? Neath yes, it is. Perfect. So we c if we increase our relationship with this guy, he can give us more of those Vigler recruits. Some of the families in this village need to raise a bit of money. They've put together a herd of 20 sheep to sell in Mosea, but with all the banditry on the road, they can't drive it there on their own. We're not merchants or landowners. We can't afford the loss. How can I help? If you're going the, in the direction of Mysea, you can perhaps take our herd to Padmos the Angel. Some villagers will come along to help you drive the animals in the other way. I will do it myself. I shall help you deliver the 30 odd sheep. Are they in my... Oh, are they in my inventory? Yes, they are in my infantry. Okie dokie. Uh, where is my Zaya? All the way up there. I say, it's actually not that deep. It's not too far away. Got some step bandits there. Different kinds of enemies. We're just going to go ahead and speed up unless we see anything. Ooh. 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 This might be one of our main quest people. Main quest nobles that we have to speak to. Oh, it's the Empress. Empress Brigaea. I am Rafael. I am Regea, rightful Empress of the Calradians. I am Lady of Inira and the Saron. The Caron. No idea. What is Nares's folly? Well, that's what some people call the Great Battle of Pendrake in the year 1077. Emperor Nerexes led an army accompanied by Cusates and Azurai to fight a coalition of Sturgeons, Batanians, and Valandians. It was a disaster for him. He died in it, but the victors didn't fare much better. I see. Can you tell me anything about the Battle of Pendrake? Of course. I did not witness the battle, but my husband Arinicus spoke frequently of it. He was one of the Emperor's trusted commanders. He could not stop Nerexes from marching to defeat, but he managed to salvage something from the disaster. 
When the Sturgeons came over our barricades, he managed to lead a group of Norex's guardsmen out back. My husband's small force held together, and were joined by stragglers and fugitives. He described the march back, no food, little water, marching day and night to keep ahead of the enemy's outriders, but they survived, the only organised imperial force to do so. The city was in a state of panic after hearing rumours of what happened. Aronicus kept things from descending into chaos. When it came time for the Senate to choose the next Emperor, there was no question that it should be him. Loved him before as a man, but that day learned to love him as something more. What a gift he was the What a gift he was to the people of Caerodia. Thank you. What a lovely person. She's very nice for an Empress, isn't she? Right, let's carry on with our journey. So that should be, yeah, 1 out of 10. So that's our first one done. We've just got 9 more to find. And I'm guessing they're going to be from every empire around the area. Oh, it's a shame. I can't help her. She'll be alright. Maybe. <laughs> Probably not. Ooh, let's go after them while we're here. Might as well. Bring these guys down. Let's attack them. Let's do this. Okay, so we're starting to get a little bit more of a force together. Get a few more troops. I mean, I could have just shut up. Could have just said charge all, but I did. Cavalry on me. Hit their left flank. I didn't click. <laughs> oh dear. God, they hit me so hard. I don't understand it. Maybe I should just try fighting on foot for a while. Seems that being on horseback really doesn't help me. Come on, boys. Get in. Get in. Lovely. Any left? No, that's a more. Perfect. Point eight morale. Oh, renown. Whatever. Same thing. Legionary. Nice. Uh, get another archer. Upgrade him. Ooh. Oh! Look at that. One sexy bastard. So how many more has he got? He's got one more? One more. So he's a cataphract and then he's becoming an elite cataphract. I like it. Gonna have some real elite cavalry soon. Only two of them, but you know. Better than none. Right, on onwards to Mazea. Let's hope our men haven't eaten too many of the sheep. I really hope they haven't. Um, was it this guy? I can't remember. Who did I need to go to? Padmos the Angel. Him. Talk. I am Rafald. About the task Nethor of Tegressos. Yes. Our friend Nethor of Tegressos sent word to us. He told us to expect you with 21 head of sheep. Here we go. Here's the sheep. Lovely. Is that it? You cheeky bastard. I feel like I deserve a little bit more than that. Oh well. I guess. Let's go ahead and sell all this. Uh, let's have a look. You. I need to give you something better first. I think I'm going to give you a shield. Not too expensive. Next. Let's give you a bit of head armour. Let's go with that leather cap. 200 quid. I'm regretting that now. Let's get you something. Let's get you something decent, but not too bad. Wow, a lady's dress is better than what he's currently wearing. Which is what? A worn military tunic. A lady's dress has more armour than. Okay. Imperial robes, a leather tunic. Let's give you some imperial robes. Not great, but it's better than nothing. Can't complain, that's a little bit of armour for him. And we'll get 21 coins for the rest. Lovely. 
Right, moving on. Uh, there are no more quests there. Okay. So, where were we going to head before? We can head down south. Oh, no. I captured it. Or we could head up north. Actually, you know what? I changed my mind. We're going to head up north. I know that there's a lot of sea raiders up top. And they often carry better weapons and armour. So, it's better stuff that we can sell. And better troops to engage in combat. I mean, we should be able to level up a bit better up there. Probably should have gone for those guys. Let's have a look in Umbrella while we're here. Risk of Rebellion, ooh. Caravan Ambush, yeah, let's do this. I am Rafald, I know your name, you've recently heard, yeah, how do you need help with the problem? Yes, maybe you can help me, usually caravans are too fast for large bandits, yeah, we've heard all this before. Heal our run, 886, that's not too bad. I'll help you myself. You want me to guide them to Makeb, which is over there, not too far. Not too bad at all. So we'll keep our distance. Let's speed it up a little bit. The village is currently on fire. As you too. Oh god. Quick, go, 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 go. Get them! Get them! Take him down, boys. Let's take him down. Use my shield. Probably a lot better. Oh, they've all got spears. Oh, I don't like this. I don't have enough health for this. Oh, no. He did not just kill him. No! <laughs> oh, you're joking. I don't know why I'm trying to block an arrow. I like that's gonna happen. Damn it. It's such a long weapon. It's just some. It's like the amount of times it's just out of reach is frustrating. Are they running or are they? I think they're retreating, aren't they? Yes, they were. Oh, I don't believe it. Well, at least it wasn't the cataphract, I guess. That's annoying. Well, our cavalry is now dead. It's a sad day. Ah, oh, but at least he's now an elite cataphract, I guess. Got to take the good with the bad. Yeah, awesome. At least we've maxed out one of them, in, I guess. Uh, do I want a better horse? Absolutely, because my one is bloody awful. Anything better? Is that better? Nope, none of it's better. I'm glad we caught you up. Awesome. Take our payment and let's get out of here. Let's keep going up north. Let's stop here and see if we can pick up some more recruits. Hopefully we can. You've got a mission, art of the trade. No, I'm going to try and avoid that just because it's expensive and I don't want to. A couple more recruits. Let's carry on heading up. Whoa, 319 now. Troop wages. I think we're going to have to look at buying a shop at some point just so we can cut down on those wages a little bit. Everywhere seems to be on fire up here. I don't think it's uh, been going too well. We've still got a little bit of stuff to sell, so we might head into the city and get rid of that. Train troops, annoyingly. Oh, I might be able to do it. I might not have enough room. Yep, I can't help you. Don't have enough room. Group troops. What's their tree like? Sturgeon soldier, heavy axeman, spearman, line breaker, raider, bowman. St 
Sturgeon Hardened Brigand. Maybe it's might be worth getting some of these guys at some point. Doesn't seem to be too bad. I imagine they're really good infantry. Oh, we'll head head into the city as we're here. Mylock, Talic, Snake Eyes, Fruit Troops, Sturgeon Woodsman. That oh, right. He looks identical to them, more or less, doesn't he? There's not much difference, is there? Trade. Right, let's get rid of some of this crap that we don't need. Just going to check, make sure none of this is better than what he's currently got. It is. But that's it. We've got no gauntlets to give him. Don't need that. Get rid of the jewellery and the leather. Get rid of the salt, because I don't think our men can eat that. We've only got one of those, so we're going to buy... Oh, that's actually quite expensive. We'll just buy a couple of those. Keep us going. Let's have a look at the arena. There's no tournament going on, so not much to do there. Right, let's move on. Let's see if we can find any more bandits. Yeah, I did it at this point, we just kind of want to train our troops a little bit more. There we go, 25. Look at that. Perfect. Right, he's fully upgraded, so you know what, he can sit back here. I don't want to lose him now. Archers, they're doing pretty well at the moment. Let's just send the infantry forward and try and train up any of the recruits. You're right, mate. Not feeling it today. No. Oh no. Got your strength back. Just like yeah, alright, fine. I guess. I'll go join the battle. After marching a column. Oh nice! <laughs> nice! Love it! Oh, I'm losing men. I think I lost a couple of recruits there, didn't I? There you go, into level. I'm always using my pole arm, won't we? Yeah, upgrade our melee skill for a little bit. Say what melee skill? Go! Oh. I'll oh, stop playing around. Amazing how much these guys can take. Seriously. Dead. Another one knocked out. Oh no, you don't. Oh no, you don't. We ah oh, really? We lost an infantryman. See how the battle can just be so volatile. You know, most of them we've cleared absolutely no problem, no losses. But oops. I didn't mean to do that. Can I reset? I can. That's what I wanted to do. Hey, we've got another horseman. He has a friend. He has a friend. Let's try and finish off these guys. Not trusting you an inch. I'm just going to send the troops. And they're going to finish them off for me. Upgrade him to a legionary. They're selling fur. And we could have a look at a bit of trading actually. So I'm going to buy some of these. Their fur. Can buy it for 36 and I could sell it at Mysea for 78 or Onira for 93. So let's buy all of it then. It does not cost that much for us to do. We could even get it for a lot less if we trade in 
these items. We will pay five coins. Lovely. Right, so we will travel down to Onira. As that is apparently the best value for the fur. We'll head down there. If we we won't make massive amounts, but if we make enough, we'll get a couple of horses and get our first horse archers together. Hopefully, we can have a fully upgraded party, and then we can go start looking at raiding some caravans. The only reason we don't want to raid some caravans early on like this is because we, if we're at war with a major faction and we get cornered, oh it's under siege, I'm not going to be able to do it. Let's go to Mysia, a little bit closer. But yeah, if we start raiding caravans that belong to a major faction, we, the last thing we want to do is get cornered by some leader that's got a hundred well-trained men compared to our pathetic little 46 small band of half well-trained, half not. Of prisons? Wow, I think I got a lot of prisons. Yep, we can sell for 85 here, so we're going to make a huge profit. Although it does go down with every sale. Every sale, it's still a lot higher than what we were looking at before. Those are ch those are war horses, and they're so cheap. What? Oh, I've just lost all my profits, but you know what? Let's buy a whole bunch of them. Oh, awesome. Seven skill points in trade. So that's improved too. And now we can actually. Oh, we can upgrade all of them. Yes! We've got our first horse shots. Horse archers, boys. Wow, I struggled to say that. Raw silk. I wonder, where can we sell raw silk? How much is it worth? It doesn't say anywhere that we can sell it. But if we just buy, say, 800s... Well, okay, we'll just buy them all. <laughs> I thought they had a lot more than that. Probably won't be able to sell them there because it's too close. We'll try Amprella. I reckon that might sell really well down south, actually. Go here. So we bought them for about 30-something. Definitely don't want to sell them there. Wow. Do not want to sell them there. We still haven't found any um haven't found any hideouts in a while. It's a bit disappointing. Let's see, can I sell it here? Raw silk fifty two, yeah that's a profit. No, we'll take it. If I sell them all, should be. How much do I buy them for? Because that is not a profit. That is definitely not a profit. We do not want to sell them there. Maybe we could start attacking caravans for these guys. There's a lot of open ground here, so we might be able to escape quite well. This could be a good place to start. Right, let's see. 56. How much is it here? That's a... Like 50, 50 odd profit, I think. I can't remember. So nine of them. Let's just run them down quickly. Infantry, go do your thing. Look at him, elite cataphract. It's gorgeous. Let's go. Let's get some speed. Or maybe not. 
91 damage. That's a lot of damage. And yet they survive. They can take the hit. There we go. He's not going anywhere. Beautiful. A couple more upgrades. A bit extra renown. Nothing major. One of each. Why not? Upgrade him. We are running out of money ever so slowly. So yeah, I think we're going to have to start looking at taking on some caravans, I think. For sure. Quite good for health. We're now out of food completely. Where can we get some food? Sheep. We've got up here. Oh, hideout. Let's get a couple of grains and let's buy ourselves a cow. Keep the men happy for a while and let's take on this hideout. Wait until nightfall. Pretty much is nightfall. And let's go. Let's do this. Cataphract and legionaries. Um, take off you two and add you two. Hopefully they can help me quite well. Right, let's charge them down. Bye. I don't think that makes me much faster, does it? Not really. If anything, I actually feel slower now. Hey, what are you shooting me for? Oh dear. I think there might be a lot of them at this hideout. And they've all got bows for God's sake. Ow! Bastard. Get away from my men. Oh, I think we've okay. We've taken out most of them already. Question is, how many more are there? Entering the cave now. For some reason, I've just sped up a little bit. Hit a speed boost. Where are they? There he is. How about the? He's done for. You're still going this way, so there must be somebody over here. I'm going that way. I love this map, though. Look at this intricate cave system. This is brilliant. This is a proper hideout, not compared to the one we did before. Not just a river. This is like a proper, proper hideout. This is awesome. Should get some really good loot from this, and I can't climb stairs. What is what? How did he get up here? You must share with me your secrets of stairs. One leader, five bodyguards. Can I take him on? Are we gonna try it? Of course, we're gonna try it. I don't want to lose any of my men. First hit, always good. Second hit. Block that, hit him, oh, get in. Slaughtered him. <coughs> Beautiful. 4.7 renown, love it. Wow, I had loads of prisoners as well, look at that. 25 of these guys and one of these guys. He's a nomad. Oh, I didn't realise they're just peasants. Uh, you know what? Yeah, go on, I'll take him on. It's just the one guy. I'm going to leave them. They're not worth it. Got a good length, but isn't better. Large bag of arrows. We don't have a bow yet, but we will take that anyway. Could swap out for a lovely fur hat. You know what? I'm going to give it a miss this time. That's got better armor. Put that on. Take the rest. Awesome. 
relations increase with nearby notables. Okay, awesome. Right, we'll leave it there. So, in the next episode, I think, when we've fully healed up um, and trained our men just a little bit better, we're going to start taking down some caravans, because we're running low on money, and our wages have gone up massively, so we need a new way of start to get a little bit of extra cash. So, we're going to hang around this kingdom, and we're going to see what kind of caravans we can take down. That'll be our goal for the next one. We'll build up some money, and then hopefully start up a little trade empire. But that is our goal for the moment. And yeah. As always guys, thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. I really do. Um, go leave some comments down below. Let me know what you think. Uh, let me know how your own playing through is going. If you haven't got the game, check it down in the link below. Um, and yeah, subscribe and hit the notification button if you want to keep updated with all the videos. There will be more coming out regularly now. Uh, yeah. Other than that, I'll see you in the next one, guys, and really appreciate you for watching. Thank you very much. Goodbye.